sky looks right now. Absolutely amazing. This is uh this is how it feels when you drive a Corvette, you know, a C5. It's just life is just good. Until it breaks down. <laughs> Got some bikers. Transmission may not be broken. The shifter linkage must be broken or something. Ah! I just broke the fucking bed. I just broke the fucking bed. I don't. I fucking around these bikes. They ain't gonna eat their ass up. I shifted into second, and that bitch broke. Like I can't. At first, I couldn't get into gear at all. So I have it in one gear, and I'm gonna have to figure out what the fuck is going on. I thought I was going to be stranded. Huh? You can't shift. I can't shift, no. Nah, but... Alright, family. So this is what I'm dealing with right now. Um, something, something's off. I don't even know what it is. I'm so mad right now. I decided to power shift into second from a light. And that motherfucker just broke. And excuse my language, but I am pissed. But I can't be pissed at nobody but myself. So it was loose and it wouldn't do anything at first. And somehow I got it into a gear. So... Um, it's in a gear now, it must be third gear, and I'm going to uh, just kind of limp it home. So, what do you guys think it is? Um, you know, so I don't want to touch it right now because I don't want to, uh, I don't want to pop it out of whatever gear it is. So, I'm going to limp it home. But, real talk, like it was only a matter of time before I snapped that shit. Because I go from first to second and I shifted so hard. I can't be mad. What do you guys think about the sound? Can you hear that? Does that sound normal? Or could it be? Y'all let me know. Now, I will say that I am kind of glad that it's breaking now when it's time for it to be put up, you know, I guess. The sucky part is that I'm going to Vegas next week, so I ain't going to have time to really do nothing with the car. So, I was just about to go put gas in it too. I wonder if this has, to do, has anything to do with the adjustment that I made. Nope, it, it can't because the gear, the transmission itself is still fine. Oh man, it's always something, but I can't blame nobody but myself. Nobody but myself. So I'm gonna get this thing parked. Um, I, I better park it right the first time because I can't put it in reverse or nothing. This here. Is it supposed to be grease down in there? I don't know. I don't know nothing about transmissions. What do y'all think? Looks like it takes some star bits. I'm gonna go ahead and get this open here. I wonder if I can put this in a different gear. All right, family. So we were able to uh, limp the car home. Um, I believe in third gear. 
So, this is what we're looking at. At first, I was like, what is all that grease in there? Is that, is that supposed to be there? But, yeah, that's supposed to be there. So, um, what I'm hoping for is that it's just something with the actual shifter and not the transmission. So, it's in third gear right now, so I would think that maybe it's okay. So, the clutch feels fine. So, there's still pressure there. When I broke my transmission, I can't remember if I could feel anything um, with the clutch or not. So, I know there is a... And I was trying to look down here, but I can't really see much. But you see how easily this moves? So, uh, I'm hoping that this part itself is just disconnected from the uh, actual ball. I hope, hopefully the ball down here is broken. And I can just put a new shifter in there and it'll be fine. But... And hopefully the, I know there's a rod, like for the transmission, there's a rod here and a rod here. And that way it'll help you select the gears. Hopefully that part, those parts are okay. Uh, Cause if not, I would think you would need actual transmission work, but I'm not sure. So what we're going to have to do is take apart the uh, center console in order to get down here to see what's going on. See, the fact that I can lift this up, I hope it's that ball. And I hope the transmission's okay. But maybe the transmission is okay it's because, because I was able to eventually get it in third. Um, yeah, we'll see. So, um, but I tell you what, um, I've had too good of a day for me to deal with this right now. So we did autocross. Um, we were messing with some bikes and that's what I get from messing around. So. Um, but today has been a great day and I'm not going to let this ruin it. So what we're going to do is take my butt to sleep. I may go edit, uh, not this video, another video. Uh, then I'm going to go ahead and go to sleep and wake up. I'm going to work. And then maybe tomorrow after my part-time job, I'll come take a look at this. But, uh, in the meantime, I'm, I'm not going to worry about it. I do want to drive the car, but then again, it's not worth ruining this wonderful day. So we'll catch you on the flip side.